Hey everybody. Okay. So, um, I want to talk a little bit. It's slow season for a lot of people. Um, just starting to kind of get into the busy season here for us with seniors and graduation. Um, but you know, it's still pretty cold here in Wisconsin. So we're not having a ton of people, um, pounding at our door like we do in the summer. So, you know, we're using this time to really concentrate on getting our past clients in the door, um, booking our seniors, you know, of siblings and things that we know that are coming in. Um, but I want to give a couple little tips of some other things that we're really working on. And, you know, here's some things that you can really think about right now. Um, and again, I'll be talking a little bit more about this at joyfreeclass.com. So check that out. But it's really, it's not with paid ads. It's really getting that organic traffic to your clients. And these are going to, I mean, to your website. And these are going to be people that are already going to love you. So you want to really think about what the top phrases are for your highly motivated clients. Um, think through what they're going to be using to, in order to search you. It's not going to be something like, Milwaukee photography. That's too broad of a search. And if you're really looking at um, developing more of a niche market and really getting in touch with people that are truly, truly interested in what you have, you want to think through not only those big topics, but also the little bit smaller ones that are going to be easy for you to rank well. And when you do that, um, you can go ahead and really work on ranking well for those more niche um, you know, Google searches. So you obviously want to make sure that it's not things that are so obscure that nobody's going to actually search for them. But you want to think through what the terms are that relate to you that are really going to be specific and bring people that are interested to your site. And then what you want to do is make sure that once the people are at your site, that you give them a reason to stick around and learn a little bit more about you. So make it super, super user friendly. Um, I want to tell you a quick little story. Um, there's a brilliant photographer. Her name's Emily Cummins, and she has just this a beautiful website. Um, and she took our class and then ended up doing an SEO mastermind with Tim and I. And she just in a few weeks has implemented what she's learned about SEO from Tim. And she's jumped from ranking under um, 100, which, you know, is like five pages into Google to now in just a couple weeks, now she's at um, the third page. So this is huge. And um, she might actually even be up to the second page already. And we know that she booked two clients solely just from it. So it's super, super important that you really get a handle on your um, keywords that are really valuable to your business. So again, if keywords and SEO is something that you're super confused about, we're doing a free webinar. So hop on at joyfreeclass.com.